Have you ever wondered how the Pixel 6 and Pixel 6 Pro exclusive live translate features work on a non-Pixel device and how they would look? Well, you're in luck today. Hey peeps, what's up? Manji here, back with another video. And if you have ever wondered how the Pixel 6 or Pixel 6 Pro live translate features would work and look on a non-Pixel device, here is the video for that. So if you go into settings and then you can go into system. Live translate, yes, you do have a separate section and a sub menu for live. Translate, you of course have toggle to enable or disable it. Download the languages over Wi-Fi only, then translate to whatever default language you want to choose. And you can also translate from. So you tap on add a language, you can download all the different languages. Now, not all features are supported across all languages. So let us say I go ahead and try to add the Hindi one. So it does tell me what all features are supported and they include messaging and camera now I have already downloaded French and Japanese so if I tap on Japanese you can see it is telling me these all features are supported which include messaging live caption camera and interpreter mode now I'm pretty sure you are here for the interpreter mode and your live caption translation so let us test out YouTube first of all so here it is we are on YouTube and I am playing a French video you can see that the translation is being done in my live caption if i tap on this i can customize it so tap on the three dot menu on the right hand side and again you have a toggle to translate the captions and then you can choose your languages now do note whatever language you have downloaded back there in the option for live translate they are going to show up over here other than the english which is by default and then you can also choose what language you want to translate to so right now i am playing a video which is in the french language it is being translated to english working like a boss super dope super dope of course i have reduced the volume on this specific video so that i do not get a copyright strike or something like that next up we can go ahead and test out the feature of your interpreter mode so let me go ahead and ask the lady to open the interpreter mode so there it is you can see it is asking me what language i want to translate to so for this one let us try english to the hindi one and see how that goes now here it is english to hindi and hey how are you i am good how are you मैं भी बढ़िया हूँ आप बताओ और क्या चल रहा है बुए वर्किंग लाइक अ बॉस देर इट इज पीप्स दैट वॉज योर इंटरप्रेटर मोड ऑल्सो वर्किंग विदाउट एनी इशूज डू नोट interpreter mode is different from google translate now you can of course have the same feature using google translate as well but to invoke interpreter mode you have to ask the assistant lady to take you into interpreter mode and therein you can say whatever language you want to translate to and from so and before we end the video let us try one more thing i have of course turned off my internet connection there is no sim in the device let us try to see if it works offline for us as well so let me go to the file manager application and try to play a video which i have locally on my device so here it is i am playing a video right now which i have on my device locally and there it is you can see live caption is working without any issues the video is in english and i am translating it to japanese we can try to switch over to french and see if that works bam there it is working like a boss with no internet connection on the device offline and that i think is super cool and super dope only if google knew how to market their stuff but so just a very small video showing you the power of the snapdragon 845 running the pixel exclusive features of live translate working like a boss